I got a very quick chance in January to get my hands on the American Acoustasonic Stratocaster by Fender after completely missing out on trying the Telecaster version last year. So I'm happy to have one to test out properly back home in my studio and see whether it's worth the hype. Can I get a drum roll? Whoa, I got myself an Acoustasonic. An Acoustasonic Stratocaster. It comes with a gig bag, paperwork and accessories, and the strings are 11s to 52s, so Fender's own coated phosphor bronze set. I've got the natural model with an ebony fingerboard. It sounds fine unplugged, obviously better than an electric. However, it can't replace a real acoustic. It's more about what it sounds like when it is plugged in. That's where the magic really happens. But first, you need to charge it via a USB cable. So remember that if you're gigging a lot, <laughs> you don't wanna get caught out. Immediately, I can tell how versatile it is as it's got five different voice pairs. They describe it in the manual as a curated collection of acoustic and electric voices that can be played solo or blended via the mod knob to create infinite combinations. Position five is with the voice selector, the switch closest to the neck, and position one is furthest away. The A voice is with the mod knob fully counterclockwise and the B voice is fully clockwise. This is me figuring the guitar out, just DI'd straight into my Zoom. Okay, so how does it do this? Fishman have designed the acoustic engine, so the guitar includes three different pickup systems. Fishman Undersaddle Transducer, Fishman Acoustasonic Enhancer, and the Fender Acoustasonic Noiseless magnetic pickup. It's also got a stringed instrument resonance system, so it's got an inlaid top and modern electronics inside that were designed specifically for this guitar. Alongside the fact that it's built in California, US of A, it kind of explains the price tag. The Fender Acoustasonic noiseless magnetic pickup does mean it's hum free, so that helps if you're live looping the guitar. Talking of live looping, I'm obsessed with finding all the different percussive sounds to create a beat. Obsessed. I don't think I'll get bored of that. I then DI'd it straight in to see how it feels when I'm singing. I was in a bad place when I first met you The red dress was on purpose and attempt to feel good No pressure to impress you, your heart belonged elsewhere Had to first learn patience, I knew you play fair In July I sat across from you, owning and revealing my mistakes The hours in that long summer day fell away to make a clean my hand and guide me through I can't help 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 falling for you 
in your hands it feels like an acoustic although it has a slim mahogany strat neck with a satin finish and deep sea profile the action the frets the sound hole and then obviously the acoustic strings contribute to that overall acoustic feeling as well as the sitka spruce top and mahogany back and sides however it has this interesting split personality with that hollow strat shaped body, the controls, and then its range. It's got 22 frets with a 12 inch fingerboard radius, a sculpted heel and a 25.5 inch scale length. So for any electric players out there that don't like playing acoustic, but might need the sound for a session gig or something, this might be for you. Now to put it through my pedal board and Orange Rocker 15, just on the clean channel. I love the resonance the body gives when it's through an electric guitar amp. The smaller body shape is there to try and eliminate on stage feedback, uh, feedback issues, especially when it comes to the acoustic sounds. It feels alive, but it might be too lively for some pedals. It's obviously not for everybody, but I don't hate it. And actually, it would be the perfect guitar for the live looping cover gigs I used to play. So I'm thinking up video ideas already that this would help with. It's lightweight too, so that could save me some back pain. And the look is growing on me. I definitely prefer it to the telly version. I also think the neck and headstock are beautiful and the satin finish is also really useful for video and on stage under bright lights. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching this video. Be sure to subscribe to my newsletter for information on my upcoming guitar courses, amongst other news. Subscribe to this channel, give this video a thumbs up, and let me know your thoughts on the Fender Acoustasonic Stratocaster. I personally think it's the perfect live looping guitar. As always, a huge thanks to my Patreon supporters who you will see the names of in the credits. If you want your name in the credits, then check out the links in the description. But otherwise, I'll see you soon. You gave a cinematic entrance, I felt time slow down. Leaves were turning, fall had come around. London felt magnetic, I was nervous all day. Deep in conversation, my hours fell away. By October, there was something here. You knew it was too hard to ignore. The tenth of the tenth was spent kissing, sat on your bedroom floor.